Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be doing the makeup through the grades of 3rd grade to 8th grade and these are all suggestions as long as it's okay with you and your family. So let's get on with the video for 3rd grade. I don't think you need that much. So all you are going to do is you're going to be putting a lip balm on because your skin is just so perfect you don't really need to put anything on it. And that's all you need. Third grade. For fourth grade, you're still going to be using your Yost lip balm, the crystal, and your suave and a moisturizer. This is for fourth grade, guys. And your skin might be starting to get dry. You're getting a little older, so you could use some lotion. And this is extra good. If you guys don't want to wear this every year, I honestly don't wear um, ever, so I don't wear lotion on my face except for winter. And I don't wear makeup to school yet. I'm allowed to just wear mascara, but I honestly don't like to. I'm too lazy to wear it. It's just cool, in my opinion. So, yeah. Fourth grade, you just need some lotion and some balm. For, for fifth grade, all you need is I don't use my lip balm in the in fifth grade because I just I finished fifth grade or the lotion because I don't really use that stuff anymore. But you guys can't. I just don't. I just not do it. I know. I never wore makeup to school. Well, sometimes I wore some lip gloss, but nothing really else. But, so, for fifth grade, you can use some lip gloss. I'm using this Lip Sense moisturizing gloss, so that's why I don't wear um lip balm, because it has, like, lip balm. And guess I'm just looking at a mirror. And you're in fifth grade. You want an adventure, but, like, you're still only in fifth grade. So you don't want to be too adventurous yet because you're only in fifth grade and stuff. So I recommend using your a clear mascara and a clear brow gel. For clear mascara, everybody's like, I'm using my app one. Um, everybody's like, what, what does that even do? I honestly just see it makes my eyelashes a little longer. It doesn't make them longer because it just makes them a little bit longer. And clear brow gel just like makes them like the shape you want them to be. The double sided thing, so I personally like it. Ugh. Ugh. Technical difficulty. I do this up, then I have to. My last meal. This is so hard, guys, but. This is so hard. Is this not even open? I really don't think. Is it also? Guys, it's hard because of the lotion in my hand. Ugh. Technical difficulty here. Ugh. Oh my god. Guys, you got it undone. So this, I'm also just looking at my mirror. Uh, uh, so how I do it? So I sweep all the brow hairs up, and you're like, and then that's the end of my look. No, guys, I'm joking. That look really bad. Unless you guys want that, it just doesn't look good on me. And then I just sweep them downward. Up, 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 up. Sweep different down, and you go. That. Is a fifth grade look, and I don't wear makeup to school. I wear some lip gloss, maybe. So this is actually fifth grade for sixth grade. You're still, um, you're gonna be using a mascara, and I think you could use. And you're only gonna use one coat, in my opinion. I'm using the Ulta Beauty one. One sweep through and that's it. One sweep through and that's it. Okay. And then for sixth grade, I think you could use a really natural brush. Blush, my sister gave this one to me. Um, my So Susan Blush and Glow. Most of my makeup used to be my sister's. She doesn't use it. 
and you don't even have to have puppy access because it's like so natural. And then lip gloss and lipstick spray. I'm still gonna be using my lips since then it's on. Sixth grade. For seventh grade, it's the same thing. You're gonna be using your blush, your mascara, and stuff. This is seventh grade, but you're gonna be adding a concealer and something else. So I'm just using my Boing Benefit Hydrating Concealer in the number two. I'm using these triangles under my eyes. And I just let them like do that zigzag. Okay, and then once I'm done, I just wipe the axe. Okay, and so I want you look me it. And I put it back in here. And take it off. And then I'm using my makeup wipe here from the yes to cut. So cut yes to cut in from Target. And then I get these unicorn brushes. I have another one. And I just like go like that. And yeah. I don't have a beauty blender, but it's really, I don't have a beauty blender, guys, because those are like twenty dollars. Is this for seventh grade? So that's it doesn't get all crazy. You grab some Revelation baking powder. I don't use this for baking because I don't need that. But I heard it's like um it like doesn't work well for baking because it like sticks on. I just tap all the axes off. Sweep sweep. Sweep sweep. Um I promise you it does not look that light on camera. I didn't realize on camera it was way lighter. So yeah, this is the Seventh so grade, eighth grade. I don't. Um, you can be using a ton of things, and and this stuff is all my sister's. Like these two things are my sister's because I don't wear foundation or primer yet. So um, I'm gonna be using my my sister's pore fashional primer. Actually, this is mine. I think I found it. Was it good? When I was getting that, um, when I was getting my um, when I was getting this, I think I got it as a free gift. And I use around that much. And you rub it in the tip of your finger. And it's like almost like a silicone feeling. Okay. And this is a little bit light for me because it is my sister's. But I tried doing this makeup look yesterday. And I promise you it does look as light as it's on camera. Okay, what I do is I touch it like that. Do three dots in each area. And then like for your chin and before you do two nose you do one and amber chin you do one. Okay, I'm wiping off it with my finger. Pouring the make pouring the fund the excess foundation back into the bottle. And this is the L'Oreal True Match. because she let me borrow it. And this is a little light, as you can tell, but it's not that light in real life. It just looks like that. And this is in the color Light Ivory. What you do is you use the same brush I use for my concealer. And like, it's just way nice. And easy to blend out. Look how natural that looks. And I don't think I'll ever wear this because I won't wear these for a while. I probably won't wear this in eighth grade, but like I know my I know one of my friends one of my sister not one of my sister's friends wears all this like she wears foundation in school, that's the reason I know that it's gonna be foundation in school. Okay. <laughs> Drop that in and can you your foundation on? You could only, you can just add a tad concealer, like that much. Put it back in the bottle. Using this, 
to wipe it all off, like drag, not drag, but like tap, 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 tap. Um, and this you might have to use a little more of your powder. Okay, I'm grabbing my powder brush, swirling around, and uh, just powdering all over so it does not crease. And this makes it already look a little better. Then with my Luxie. 249 brush. I'm gonna where this isn't any great look. I'm gonna just dip into like the naturalist. I'm gonna dip into the LMA 220 less is more quad and I'm gonna go into this color right here. With the fluffy side, because this is a double side brush. And this is the top. And I feel like you could add this to your sixth grade look if you wanted to. And you have of course. And then my mascara I already put on. I forgot to take that off actually. Um, and some gloss. I feel like you could add a little bit more color to your gloss. I'm just grabbing some pink. You could either add this pinky one, or I'm just gonna use this one that I got for a present from my friend. Try me this glow. And I'm just gonna go on the tips and the lips. Tips a minute. And then and then you wanna set it off with a setting spray. Which is just also my sister's is the Urban Decay All Nighter spray. Wait no. This wasn't my sister's, I got this friggin'. The only thing here I actually think is Lucy's is the no, Lucy my sister's is this. Foundation. Yeah, this is a pretty good job. I was also getting when I was getting this from also for a video. I had to get it for my sisters. I had to get it for something. I forget what though. They gave me that. Okay. And this is the eighth grade look. Oh, eighth grade. We're forgetting something. This also goes in the seventh grade. The blush. So you. You, you're older now, so you can dip into like a more pigment tint. I'm using this Patrick Star MAC collaboration. Dipping in here, tapping the axis off. This is my blush brush. Two real techniques. And you just go to sleep. Sleep. And this is the look. So guys, saw it. I'm still in my eighth grade look. I'm still a little too much rain because I'm only in sixth grade. And so I really hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe and hit that notification bell down, down below so you can see when I upload new makeup videos hacks diys because this is a diy channel i haven't been doing that much DIYs because i actually need to go somewhere to get my diy stuff my girls actually and if you guys want to see me testing up new cool things like these bears there might be a video on this we should please like and subscribe and if you guys want to have a comment down below please say and no way guys i work really hard on this um, let's see what the question should be. Ooh, what grade are you going into? And do you wear makeup to school? I don't. If I did, I'd probably just wear lip gloss. Maybe a little mascara, but I don't wear any. I'd probably just wear lip gloss and stuff. So, guys, bye. Till next time.